Hello friends and welcome to the Saitama Stacker channel. My name is Dean. If you are watching my videos for the first time, please know I only make them for entertainment, education, and for community building around the Saitama token. So please do your own research before investing. Okay folks, another tough day for Saitama. And it kind of got me thinking here. I mean, this is going to seem pretty obvious, I guess, to most people. But I used to watch a, or listen to a podcast. It was called The Survival Podcast. The guy who does the podcast is named Jack Spierko. I listened to it for several years when I was commuting as a traveling salesperson. I worked in pharmaceutical sales. So I'm driving around. And one of the things that they talked about that really fascinated me was a practice called permaculture. And it would be like, extraordinarily high level gardening and integrating different systems together. But one of the things they talked about with this permaculture was that the problem is often the solution. So when you have a problem, if you can take that problem and tweak it to your advantage, then it becomes the solution to the problem. The problem right now in the community, as far as I'm concerned, you know, just my opinion, <laughs> but it seems pretty evident is that the Cytomask launch went not well at all, honestly. I mean, it, it certainly wasn't uh, what anybody would have uh, wanted in terms of the way it's gone down. And it's had some adverse effects on the token, but it's also had some really adverse effects on the community as there's been a higher level of drama, and some infighting. So to turn this frown upside down, we need to make that problem the solution. We need Cytomask to be up and running. We need for people to be able to start using it and see it for what it hopefully is. Okay, Now, if, if we get our hands on this thing, they open it up to trading, they launch tokens on there, and we're able to go in and smoothly swap in between these, things could go very well for Saitama. If, when they turn it on, it doesn't work as advertised, it could be detrimental. So... We're keeping our fingers crossed for a great app. Now we know it's been Certic audited, so we know the security of it is good, and hopefully the coding and programming of it is going to be good as well. The interface, the actual look of the application is beautiful. I did kind of a walkthrough with it last night with mine. Once I was able to open it up, I left it completely unchanged. And in a live stream, I went through and looked at some of the different functionalities. There's things in there that I really, really like. Uh, for instance, there's analytics right inside each token. So you select a token and you can scroll and right below it, it shows you the returns on that. You can look at the charts, you can look at the volume, you can look at the market cap. It's really got some nice function and compared to other phone wallets or uh, phone applications, mobile applications, to me, it looks like head and shoulders above anything else is currently available. So this could be the catalyst that turns the tide. But in the meantime, it's been tough. Now the crypto market in general has been tough, but Saitama has been deeply affected in the last 20 days. So just to look at the fundamentals, there's currently 320,860 wallets. That's an increase of 363 over yesterday. The market cap is now 850 million. Okay, that's two days now that we've bumped below a billion. And the sad part of that to me is we are now below, just barely below the lowest market cap in the CoinGecko top 100. So they're 850, we are 849, okay? A million dollars off. Now that represents a 64% decline in the 20 days since Cytomask was supposed to launch. And I do not put the price, downward price pressure wholly on the development team. It's not on Max, but we have to be honest and admit that while the market has been tough, um, we've probably taken some extra lumps because people are walking away from the project. They're starting to lose faith. So this is the opportunity for the development team to put us all back on track to give us a working product and see what we can do with this. Now, it won't just be us, right? This isn't just about the Saitama community. If we're listing eight tokens, those tokens are already out there talking and they have their own communities. Some of us overlap into those communities, but quite frankly, I haven't looked too deeply into very many of those coins. So 
once those are listed on Cytomask, it should be compounded in terms of the visibility of it by all of those tokens communities. And it's an extra medium for them to trade on. There'll be some tokens on there that they can't get anywhere else when they launch Lily Token. So um, I'm very, very hopeful. And I think we've got uh, some information as to what the roadmap looks like here in the near future uh, coming our way in the next 24 hours. And I'll show you that here towards the end of the video. The price currently seven zeros one nine. The volume eight million four hundred thousand. The burn still sitting at fifty six point two one. At the current volume and price, it would take one hundred and fifteen days to burn one percent. That's about three point one six percent per year. And the ten day moving average for the burn four point six nine. Total tokens burned in the last twenty four hours four point seven trillion. All right. So I want to show you two things. First of all, I wanted to give a shout out and say thanks to Sinky. Sinky is a member of the Stacker community, and he just copied me in tweet for something that as we did our walkthrough last night, I didn't test out. But it's just a, a really nice piece of functionality, and this is posted by Saitama Israel, and it says, to those who underestimate what Cytomask is, I can easily see how it's going to be used for online and in-store purchases not too far from now. These guys had the future in mind. So... Basically, with one button, you can scan a QR code. In this case, they're talking about sending tokens, but you could use it to receive tokens the same way. And when we get to the point where this app is capable of spending, where you could buy directly from um, the online resources, and that is built into the functionality they're looking at having a marketplace, you should be able to seamlessly use your wallet to make purchases, which is really, really cool. So Sinky, thank you very much for the heads up. When I talked about this being a community token and a community, this is the way that you can help me to create better, meaningful content. Just point out things that are uh, interesting going on in the community. All right. The other piece of content that I liked on Twitter today, this is uh, Anton Nazarov, and he's just showing on a couple of tablets, Cytomask. And it just looks beautiful. And I don't know, this person's got some uh, filming experience because... You can see the lighting is good and the, you know, the color in the room. I don't know if they've got a filter on or what's going on, but it really is a beautiful app. So if it will work as advertised and we can get it moving, get it in everybody's hands, it could be huge for the community. This could put us back on the path to pushing the price in the right direction and building the community, which has kind of stalled out in the last 20 days. The number of new wallets we're seeing every day is lagging behind where it was in the past and certainly... You, I mean, the market cap speaks for itself down 64% in the last 20 days. Okay, so it's time to make the problem into the solution and get this going in the right direction. Tomorrow, there will be an AMA. This is at 4 p.m. Central Standard Time. My guess is we'll see Max and we'll see Russell on there and that they're going to lay out a roadmap for us knowing what's going on with uh, Cytomask, when we're going to be able to use it, when tokens are going to be listed. So I've uh, set a reminder for it. I'm going to post a link to this in the description of the video. If you um, want to use that, it will just help you find the content on YouTube. So you can also put a reminder on and watch that. And I'll retweet it so that uh, you guys will be able to pull the link from there as well. Should be very interesting. And I'm hopeful that they're saying, okay, we're there, we're flipping the switch, go nuts. And that when we do go nuts, it works seamlessly. One last thing I want to show you before I look at reflections is that we do continue to be in the top 10 Ether hot pairs on DexTools.io, currently sitting at number two. And the, the definition for this is, it just says these pairs reflect how popular and trending they are among the community. They do not represent any investment advice or endorsement of the Dex uh, Tools team. So... It just shows us there's a lot of eyes on us still. Okay, people may have given up or may have kind of jumped out of the project, but a lot of people are still looking enough that we're the number two token in the Dex Tools uh, top pairs space. So as quick as we've seen some uh, price pressure to the downside, we could see this flip right back around if we can get uh, Cytomask up and running get it in people's hands 
and start moving that volume back in a, the positive direction. All right, I wanna quickly show you my reflections and then sign out for today. In the last 24 hours, I've received just under 47 million free Saitama tokens for being a holder. If you wanna learn more about that, go to the official SaitamaToken.com website under the ecosystem tab, and there is a description of how that program works. But since November 21st, I've received three and a half billion free Saitama tokens, currently valued at just under $80. So um, it is something that builds over time. And you can imagine if I can just hang on to this, not only should I get price appreciation, but additional tokens and the value of these that I'm getting now could even exceed the amount I have invested in the project over time. I hope you have an amazing day. Hang in there. Uh, we'll see if this project will turn around here very soon. Check back with me tomorrow. We'll watch our Saitama stacks grow together.